hello viewers welcome to my channel there is something i want to explain to you i will make sure i will explain it to you one by one to understand about the six steps to start a poultry farm in nigeria then the step one is to is uh, choose the type of uh, bed and step uh, and and two step one is choose the type of bed two is security and work three is uh, select a suitable farm location four is to provide a good shelter for beds five is medication and feeding of the poultry then a uh, poultry bed then six is marketing the beds and the eggs then let me be going around. I will be explaining it one by one to under, for you to understand it. Step one is choose the type of uh, beds. The type of beds you will choose uh, is like this one is layers. Then you will know the uh, the one you will choose. This one is layer. Some may choose broiler. Some may choose the uh, guinea fowl. Another beds is the is the one you will choose if you want to uh, if you are to start a poultry farm then whether in addition some people may like to go into ostrich uh, and like me i normally look at ostrich as a wider bed then the step two is a security and uh, uh, security and works uh, and uh, and, and the workers then that means the manpower in that place those things you must put uh, in place by setting a poultry farm thing is that if you set a poultry farm without any security on it the only thing is that when your workers they will go poultry farm normally operate in the morning and in the evening once the workers will, will leave the uh, the criminals will enter inside and take everything from your farm before you uh, then in the money you come you will not see anything in the farm that's why i said security and uh, workers that one is step two those things we you will just uh, consider and this step three is a uh, select a suitable farm location if you want to start any farm you must select a suitable location to site it at don't site your farm at the rural uh, area. I mean, at the urban area. The only place you can start your farm is at the rural area. Then, if you start your farm at the urban area, that one is a red uh, flag. The head official will come and disturb you. Before you know what is going on, your farm will be closed down. Except you have a machine that... Uh, you can uh, pack the droppings, poultry waste out. Except you can get a machine, you will pack this uh, poultry waste out. And the selecting uh, a farm uh, aspect of the time I'll, is that I'll, I'll, I want you to uh, uh, get the farm aspect of time because it will be cheaper. And the only thing is that don't build as a beginner. If you are going to start a farm, don't build any uh, house, uh, a, house, uh, a farm. Just rent. Once you rent, there is a lot of farm there. Once you rent, then you start. That one is uh, cheap. Then you start with it. And for me, I can advise you to start with uh, poultry and go and learn it. And number four, is uh, provide good shelter for the best and the place you are going to start the best is that the uh, the fourth step is that the best must have a, a good shelter look up here here is open you can see how here looks like now here is open there is ventilation because the roof here you can look the roof the sun will hit here and if the hair is not high and the other side is not open it will affect this bed and this one will reduce the number of eggs this bed will lay 
Assuming this bird is laying one egg in 26 or 27 hours, if this bird is stressed, it's not going to lay any egg in a day. You are going to run into losses. I'm telling the fact. You are going to run into losses. And uh, number five is medication and feeding of the poultry. Best. Like now, I can see now. This is the poultry bed, uh, the feed now they are eating now. It's a uh, layers mash. It's not pallet, uh, palletized uh, feed. It's layers mash. They are eating it now. You can see how they are eating it. We normally feed them two times in a day. We feed them in the morning. We feed them in the evening. That evening we normally feed them. The time we normally feed them in the evening is uh, 4 o'clock. In the morning, you start from 7 o'clock, and in the evening, it's 4 o'clock. Don't skip the time. Because if you skip the time, I've already observed it several times. If you skip the time, you are, it's uh, going to affect the eggs. I'm telling the, uh, you the truth. It's the practical. I'm telling you the practical. Once you skip, if you're a poultry farmer, just skip time. It will affect your bed. And the other one is the medication. The medication you are giving your bed, you must give the bed at when you give them an antibiotic and give them cosidesis. The only thing that you have to know is that you have to uh, schedule how you will give them a uh, medicine. And another one, not only to schedule how you'll be giving them medicine. Like now, here is a poultry cage. You will come down and check the droppings. Here, this is the droppings now. You can see the droppings, how the droppings looks like. There is no co uh, co uh, cosine on it now. It's normal uh, droppings. And let me see, this eggs now is a new layer. This bed is a new layer. You can see the eggs now. It drop one egg upon the, uh, as we remove all the eggs, they are still laying. We removed all the eggs now. They keep on laying. They lay eggs based on the uh, hours. Like every uh, 26 to 27 hours. Eh? Like one may lay 30 minutes, other one may lay 37 minutes. It depends. Not all of them will lay the same time. I'm telling the fact. I'm telling you about this experience. The sixth one is about the marketing. And when you consider those things, eh, then you consider about the marketing. The marketing is that this bird, as it's laying eggs, you are, if you are the one that is going to start the pottery, this farm, as this egg is being laid, then you collect the eggs and you can take it to the urban area and sell. You may have a shop in urban area, they will come to that your shop in that place and buy those eggs there. The only thing is that locate your farm at rural uh, 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 area in the village that one is the best thing when you locate your farm at the village these uh, droppings of uh, poultry droppings the head official will not disturb you let me see let me show it to you here at the back of this place is farm the other side is farm is uh, for me to show it to you you can see that it is uh, at the rural area, not in urban area. Locating is an urban area. You must have a, a machine that will pour the the uh, animal uh, waste product that will dry it immediately, and you back it. That's all. Like this level, so locating in urban area is difficult. That's why th this is the only six steps to start a poultry farm in Nigeria. I hope you enjoyed this channel. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.